The first question in this part says, here are four digit cards. We have five, six, seven, and eight. And again, it says, use each card once to make this statement correct. So here we have two factors in one product. We have to use two of these digit cards in the factors place and two of them in the product place. To find out, we have to first do some calculations and see which numbers go where. So if we multiply, let's say five times six, five times six is equal to 30. So if we put five here and six here, we will not have three and zero in the product place. So in this case, we cannot use these two. What if we use six times seven? Six times seven is 42. Again, we don't have the digits for the product. What if we multiply seven and eight? Seven times eight is equal to 56. So if we put seven here, eight here, and we will have the place for five and six. This is the calculation that we can use to fill each box in this statement. So we can write seven here, seven, eight here, five here, and six. Seven times eight equals 56. Well, the first question is done.